Okay, so um, today is January 20th, 2017, Friday, um, and I've been trying to work out hosting a competition, but it's probably not going to work out before the qualifying phase. So I'm trying to get the other people who are trying to host a competition to hold a few of the upcoming events. I was trying to hold for the competition for people to qualify. So yeah, hopefully that works out. And I probably would just end up posting my competition late May, early June, something like that. So I'm um, continuing on for the Stewart Comp. Um, for Skew, I want to get sub 6.5 in a second. I need a time issue. I wanted to make sure I tied it this time before it was more difficult at the end. Anyway, so Skew, I want a sub 6.5 average at least. By the comp, in the comp, I mean, official, um, maybe even sub six or sub state record, which is like 5.91. Um, I don't know, I haven't really done skew in a while, but uh, if I do quite a bit of practice, I can probably be averaging sub six consistently. That'd be cool. These beginners with probably about like half. I just want to say hi. Hi. About like half of um, intermediate. Sarah's intermediate, um, Augs, and, um, so yeah, sub six is definitely possible for averaging that. Here, Ming, I want to, um, also get a sub, I want to get a sub 6.5, maybe even sub six average. I, sometimes, some days I average sub six, sometimes around six seconds. This last comp, both, um, the last round, I got, um, uh, me getting the 11 gave me a counting 8. If I got, like, another 5, it would have been a sub 7 average, definitely. But in, um, in the, I think it was the second round, yeah, I got a 7.00 average. That was close to sub 7, but not. Um, then in the, let's see. Oh, yeah, um, if they hold forward for an OH... Oh, wait, 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 I forgot Mega Minx. I need to practice a lot of Mega Minx to get sub to, you know, I think I already said this a little bit. But then, oh, yeah, because the cut, soft cutoff sub two, is 210. So, yeah. Um, if they have 4x4, four four, just sub 55. Because um, I got a 5507 average this last time. So, sub 55. Be nice. Maybe even a sub 50 single. Um, Special PB single now is 51.1. It was almost sub 50, but I kind of had a little bit of a lockup. Um, what I think it was a Y perm, but I'm not exactly sure. It was a little while. It was a few weeks ago, so I can't be sure exactly what PLO I got on that specific salt. But um, it's on my channel. And um, let's see, I uh, my PB is 48. But I have gotten quite a few sub 50s, and I don't do 4x4 four four a lot, so if I did like a lot of solves, I'd probably get a faster PB. You know? And uh, if they have OH, sub 25 average, sub 23 single. This last comp, I got a 27 average. It's gonna be a 26 average or so, but I got a. I was almost got a 24. Like, my solves started, I think it was 28, 27. 26, 25, and then the last solve was almost a 24, but I got a little, I messed up on the PLO and I got a 27, so counting solves, 27, 27, 26, it ended up being a 27 average, would have been a 26 average, because it would have been 25, 26, 27, that would have made a 26 average, but it's fine, I have more comps with OH, so yeah, also those people that said hi earlier in the video, I had no idea who they were, I don't know, I, it was probably just, I don't know, but I really had no idea who they were, I had never met them in my life, so yeah. I just got my first sub 2 on Mega Ming. um, my, uh, I had a really loud reaction, and I was pretty excited, so, first sub 2 on Mega Minx, that's pretty exciting. I was actually on last layer at like 1 minute 30 or something, and... Uh, I think last layer usually takes a little quicker. It's just that I was a little nervous 
Um, but I didn't mess up the case. That's a good thing. I was just going a little slower than normal. Um, but I did do good. And um, on like the last F2L, like the part where like you're... Sometimes I fill in these parts. And on this last off, yeah, I had like only four F2L pairs to do. Because at the beginning, there was an easy pair that was already done. So I put it in while I was doing um, these blocks. So then I only had like four. And I was doing a little slow on there because I could tell... Like, really, I was only had, like, two more of these blocks left or something, like, two or three. Like, par I was finishing, like, this one, I had, like, two more, what, I don't know exactly what color, like, 59 seconds. And I was getting those done, and then I had the F2L pairs, and then I did last hour. I actually always start on white, because if I don't, I mess it, I mess up, but, yeah, that was pretty cool. Hello, guys, it's 8.55, almost 9 o'clock. I've been... For the past like hour and a half i've just been editing vlogs i have six done and five to go because i hadn't edited any since january 10th so i did 10th 11th 12th 13th 14th and 15th so now i just have since um monday and today's saturday monday it was no school it was martin luther king day but junior martin luther king jr day i'm um, pretty sure that's what is uh anyway so i am now gonna be editing monday through friday which probably should be a little quicker monday will probably be kind of long but other than that i can probably might be able to get tuesday through friday in one vlog so that's pretty cool right now i only have i have three vlogs for um six days three of them in one one in its own and two in its own so yeah and um now I'm so hopefully just two most three more vlogs to edit and create. So yeah. So it's nine thirty six and I finished um editing all the vlogs so for the past like, two hours or so. Um and it was a total of only six vlogs. So now I'm just gonna um order some dominoes. Even though it's the morning my parents had to go to the karate school for like some morning class and uh, I don't really have anything to, like, have, so I'm just gonna have to order Domino's, because I'm hungry, and I'm gonna do that now, because then I take a shower, and then by the time I'm done, my shower should be here. So, anyway, then, I'm after I eat my Domino's and everything, I'm gonna do some cubing, then go to David's, and David said he wanted to go to the skate park or something, so we'll work out if, where we're gonna go, or if we're gonna go, so yeah. And I'm gonna learn some more EG one x Okay, so I'm stupid. Domino's opens at 11 o'clock. I'm stupid. I don't know why I didn't think of that. It's 9.38, so I'm still going to order it now, and it'll be, like, made and sent out at, like, 11 o'clock or a little after or whatever. So, yeah, I'm just going to order it now. So, like, I'm probably, instead of ordering it later, it'll probably come sooner because I order now, then I'll be higher up in, like, the waiting. So, yeah. So, it's been an hour since my last video. Um, I was... Um, well, I changed, I uploaded a post to my Instagram about me going to the competition, doing some other stuff and stuff. Then I took a shower, and right after I got out, put my clothes on, was about to brush my teeth, brush my hair, heard the doorbell ring. <laughs> Good timing. Right after um, I was out of the shower. So, yeah, it's the Domino's pizza. And yeah. So, now I'm gonna eat my food while I watch Carpool Pockets uh, vlog from yesterday. So yeah. I'm going to David's house now. So let it let us walk to David's house. We are walking. We are on currently on his driveway. We are currently passing the cars in his driveway. We're currently passing his garage. Now passing some chairs and plants and a bell. Let's ring the doorbell. So right when I was about to ring the doorbell. My um, mom, um, my mom called me, so that's what ended the video, and she told me to go back because my dad wasn't answering his phone and tell him to bring the blower. Because my mom's painting the sidewalk or something at the karate school. Okay, so after my mom told me to come back, she said that, uh, well, my dad said that he, she had already... He had already answered his phone by then, so he already knew, so I didn't even need to. Now, we're back on our journey to David Anthony Moreno's house. 
aka Sonic X568. Past the garage, passing some plants and shares. Now, here's for the moment of truth. Poor timing. When you're on last two edges, if uh, you have it where these are not the same, and you flip this edge by just doing that, and if these pieces are the same and these pieces are the same, then you just place it over like that. And do that. And that's all. So I was just doing 4x4 four four and that happened. So yeah, let's put that back together. So, I just got a 133. I just uh, reset the timer. But the centers were 21 seconds and then the reduction was like 50 seconds. And then 3x3 three three stage was like 22 seconds. So close to PB, but the centers were so fast. The edges, I could have been faster, but I kind of got nervous, and it was a little slower. Usually my, um, I, I, usually my edges take like a little under 50 seconds or so, like 45 seconds or so to do my edges, and then my centers usually take like 30 seconds. So the edges took like, they took like, um, Five, a little five like five or so seconds more it would have been sub 130 if the edges were a little faster but it was close my pb's is like 132 but um yeah it's pretty cool <laughs> i got a 21 second centers i'll show you the scramble real quick i was gonna show you the scramble but i um accidentally did the next scramble so i'll show it in a second with a different five by five i'll just do the solve and i'll show you after I'm pretty sure right now I misscrambled because originally I think it was like this. Something like that. Yeah, I'm, I'm pretty sure I misscrambled. Anyway, I'll just tell you what it was like. The scramble was like, it had like a bar that was about to go down. I think it was on yellow or something. But I'll try to get it on white. Let's see. I think it was like this. This was like this. I'm pretty sure it was like this. So I went like this. But it was on yellow. And then the rest of the center was like nice. So that's why it was 21 seconds. So yeah. So it's like 3.50 and David left for the skate park like 30 minutes ago, ago or so. I didn't go with him because I'm feeling kind of tired and um, and it's kind of hot out. So I just don't feel like going this time. I'll go with him next time though. Anyway, um for the last like little while like 30 minutes or so i've been doing three by three and i've been um uh talking with this other uh person trying to host a comp and he's um gonna try to host it in probably the first two weeks of march or so and um and it's a good thing that he i found out he is 250 kilometers away from the other kid in merritt island trying to host his on march 18th which um uh the delegate just verified so that's pretty cool i didn't think he was but uh, apparently he is so that's really cool that he's able to um host his in the that month so i'm just trying to see if everyone can try to split up between them a few of the unusual events i was trying to host so hopefully that ends up working out so people can qualify for these events so yeah John. max is going to the bathroom all right, so the other day... Wait, wait, um... Well, because Sean messed up the freaking video. No, you've video. messed it up. No, you messed up the video. Since okay, Sean no, messed up the video, I we messed, had to do I didn't know. Oh, you have to hurry up, though, but the thing is that... Shut well, up. I'm the, you're the one that messed it up because I edited you correctly. You turned the phone after. So hurry up. So, this is my whole type of thing. Don't show them more questions. Okay, so the other day I was fishing and I found a dead catfish over here that was really creepy and I told Sean about it and his mom and she said that another one appeared the other day and so we're gonna show you it because Sean's a baby and doesn't like to go near dead things I'm not going over there because I'm not on you yeah yeah sure whatever and here it is the dead catfish carcass with its entire like guts and everything ripped out can you, can you 